Hey everyone, it's Amy again with Bargain Mama and today is Saturday. I did just finish my Walmart grocery haul and I decided to split it into two because I did get groceries and I also got things for school and they were having their amazing back to school sale. I don't know when school's going to be back in session, but eventually it's going to have to be back in, right? So just like I stated in the previous of my other video, I did watch one of my videos and I must have said um about 30 times. So I want to apologize and I'm really going to work on that. Also, I want to apologize today. I am extremely out of breath and I don't know why, but I am talking a little bit quieter to try to, I guess, not have to take the deep breath so many times. Also, I just want to say, if you do like what you see, please like and subscribe below or at least leave me a comment so I know what I'm doing wrong or what I'm doing right. And with that being said, let's go ahead and get into this Walmart haul, okay? So first I wanted to show you guys these socks, okay? These say squeeze the day with little lemons and they were $1. And how cute, like this is, this lemon right here is all fuzzy and sticks out a little bit. This is by No Boundaries and it is the shoe size four to 10. I do have a very big foot and so I do wear a 10 and these fit me good. So these are the low cut sock. Again, it says squeeze the day and it's for $1 and I just love that saying. So I got those. I also, I absolutely love these. These are little wiener dogs that are hot dogs with fries and hamburgers, you guys. Like, these are so flipping cute. First of all, I love a hot dog. Like, I would probably pick a hot dog over anything. They're just, I love hot dogs. So, anyways, these are really cute. Oh, this side has pretzels, so that's really cute. Again, these, uh, these all were $1, and they are the No Boundaries. And it comes with one pair, which is fine because I never have a problem with the no boundary socks. They last a really long time for me. And again, in a previous one, I think you guys have heard that my husband is not happy that I always steal his socks. So, and it should literally be, I don't know who's job, but well, there should be somebody who just gets paid to do socks, to match socks up, because it is the worst job in the world. I have a huge laundry basket that probably has a hundred pairs in it. I just can't bring myself to sit there and match all those pairs back together. So instead, I either steal his, because he does match his socks all the time, or I just buy more, because I hate matching socks. It's horrible. So anyways, I got these ones. I absolutely loved the cactus. We do live in Arizona, so I thought that was very cute. And then the llama. You guys, that's so cute. And the llama is like, the white right here is like a 3D kind of, so it's really cute. And again, these were all a dollar by No Boundary. This is the last pair I got, and I just got this to remind myself, no bad days. It has been a little bit rougher at work this week. I am going to do a video on that to let you guys all know we did get the COVID-19 in our building and it is fastly spreading. So I was gonna just kind of tell you guys firsthand like what patients are going through because it's something that I wouldn't have thought and that the news doesn't show you, but I will do that in a later video. So anyways, this says no bad days. And look at the colors at the top, very cute. Anyways. It's just very cute. I loved it. The colors are extremely cute also, so I got that. I'm trying to see what I paid for these. So I got these. They are the ballpoint pens. I'm just going to take them to work. There are 15 of them for 50 cents. I always forget my pen when I get to work, and my boss puts a whole thing on her, on her desk, but I've probably used them all, so I feel like I need to replenish them for the next time I forget my pen. So it's just 50 blue ink pens medium point 1.0 just so I can make my little notes about what I do with my patients. Let's get started on all the stuff I found in their school section. I have my other receipt right here because I want to tell you guys the amazing deals that I got on these. So let's see first let's start with these Crazy Art 12 colored pencils. These I got for 50 cents each. So this is a really really good deal. This, I don't know if my kids are still going to need it, but I can use it for my crafting section. Or I was thinking of putting my niece together, like I'll, she likes to draw and she's always like making 
like little sketches of dresses and all this stuff. And so I thought, well, for 50 cents, it's cheaper than the Dollar Tree. So I got them. And like I said, somebody is going to end up using them. So again, they are, there's 12 of them. It's by Crazy Art. Non-toxic, thick, strong lids. They were 50 cents each. I did get, I believe, four of these ones. These are the Crazy Art Classic Markers. And I do make a shirt that I put a print on that is just an outline of a print. And then I sell the shirt with these, with markers. And you can, kids can actually color it. And then you can, what am I thinking? So then they, they're washable. So then you can stick them in the washer and the kid can, you take the shirt out and they can color their shirt again. So it's a really cute idea. And these again, 50 cents cheaper than the Dollar Tree. This one's coming open. So I did get four of these and there's 10 of them and they are by Crazy Art. They did also have 10 of these in the um, Crayola for a dollar. But again, these I just sell with my shirts and so I did just get the Crazy Art. It doesn't matter what kind you get for them. These are number two wood pencils. I don't know why it's so hard to find wood pencils, but it is extremely hard to find wood pencils. And these have 24 in them and I got them for a dollar, I think 96 cents. I got these for. And again, I have one of my kids will be a sophomore in high school and one of them will be a freshman in high school, a freshman in college, I'm sorry. So I'm sure that eventually they're gonna need these. So there is 24 in there. So I just got them to have on hand. This is just an, the fourth one of the markers that I got. These right here are just the pencil top erasers, 10 of them by Pentel. And these, I believe, oh, let me just look real quick, guys. I'm sorry. I have it right here. I think that they were 96 cents, but I can't remember. Okay, these are the notebooks. Okay, well, I'm sorry. I should have... There goes my whole bag. Okay, so I believe that these were 96 cents also. Um, yeah, so I think these were 96 cents. And again, they have 10 of them. They're latex free, which is extremely important because late, if anyone in the classroom has a latex allergy, you don't wanna bring anything latex in. So anyways, I just thought it was a really good deal for those. My whole bag fell. So. Let's see what we got here. Sorry, guys. Let me get all these. I got four, I believe. Sorry. The notebooks, the composition. Anyways, I did get four of the composition notebooks. They are 100 sheets, wide rolled. Dang it. I thought that they were college rolled. I don't know if they'll be able to use these. Anyways, they were only 50 cents each. So if not, they can use them for something else, journaling or whatever. This is by Pen and Gear. Again, they are the composition notebooks. I did get them in, they were 50 cents again. So I got them in the orange splatter, in the black and white splatter, red, and I got them in one other color. I just don't know where it's at right now. I did, again, think it was the college rule, but there you go. So that was 50 cents each. I got several of, sorry, this is falling off my lap the pen and gear one subject notebooks. And this is 80 sheets and these are college rolled, thank goodness. This one right here is college rolled and this one was 25 cents, you guys. For 25 cents, you can't beat it. So I got a couple of these. I think I got three of these because they are only one subject and I do believe that they do need the, um, there's the um again. They need several of the multi-subject notebooks, but they do sometimes need the one subject. They do tear out right here. And it is the eight inches by 10 and a half inches. So I got them that. Here is the pen and gear. They're stuck together. I'm not gonna spend my time trying to get them apart. One subject notebooks. Also, these only have 70 in them and they were also 25 cents. And they also are one subject and they rip out right there. So I got one in green and one in red and they're stuck together. So I'm gonna leave them like that till after and then figure it out. 
Those are for their school. Again, 25 cents, you guys. That's an amazing deal. Oh, that was almost the end of that bag. Sorry yeah, for all the rustling. I just got one of these because I thought it was cute. It was 20 cents. It is a big um, eraser. So again, by Pen and Gear, it is like the generic Walmart brand, but it's an eraser and it was 20 cents. I got this solid founder pouch. I figured if my kids don't use it, it was 49 cents by Pen and Gear. And it is a really good material, not a thin one, with this eraser, I'm sorry, this zipper up at the top. And I'm trying to see what does it say. It doesn't say what it's made out of, but it says solid binder pouch. But again, it's a really good material. So I did get this for 49 cents from there. I only got one. This is the Elmer's Washable Disappearing Purple School Glue, 50 cents for both of these. For name brand, 50 cents for two. Again, this is, I thought, a really good deal from Walmart. So instead of driving all the way to the Dollar Tree or waiting to see if school is going to go back in session, I just decided to pick these up just to have around the house. And yeah, so these are two of them, the washable disappearing purple 50 cents for two of them. This is a two-in-one sharpener for my little pencils over there, my wood number two pencils. This was 30 cents, I believe. It's a two-in-one sharpener by Pen and Gear, which is the Walmart brand for school stuff. It says sharpens number two and jumbo pencils and crayons. So I guess that's why it's two in one. I got it in blue just because I like that color. And I have boys and if I would have gotten the pink, they would have never used it. I don't know if they're gonna need it, but they might. So in one of my previous ones, I did show you all that we are having like a kid's table at my wedding. So I got these, these were 50 cents. They had the color art, I believe it is, for 25 cents for a 24 pack. But I did get the name brand Crayola, 24 crayons for 50 cents each. So, I mean, you can't beat that. And I wanted to just make sure that they were a really good, I guess, brand for when we put them on our table at our wedding. My kids do not need crayons normally because, again, they're in high school and college. But so these are for our wedding and for our kids table and again it's 24 crayola crayons for 50 cents so you need to run out there and get them because that's a better deal than the dollar tree this is the elmer school glue oh, i'm sorry it is four fluid ounces for 50 cents again name brand they did have the generic brand for 25 cents but i mean 50 cents for a name brand glue is not bad so i just got that one I'll do those ones in a minute. I got a ruler. I don't know if my children are going to need it. I'm not sure. It is a just a wooden ruler, 12 inches. It was 25 cents. Again, I don't know if they're gonna need it, but I might need it for my crafting. So I got it because it was on, I don't wanna say sale, but, excuse me, but everyone knows that has kids or that goes into stores. Everything is so much cheaper for back to school. So I just got it in case I need it. This will probably be like a dollar later. Yeah, I got it for 25 cents. This right here, I don't know if my children are going to need it, but for 50 cents, I believe, let me just make sure I'm telling you the right price. Let me just make sure. So this is the, okay. Sorry guys, give me one second here. I think this is it, no. Okay, I don't know. I believe, oh, compass. So this was 97 cents, yes. And the protractor was 50 cents. So I got these two. They had these two in a pouch for 4.97, the exact two things. And this was 97 cents and this was 50 cents. So of course I'll buy them in two separate packages and put them in my own pouch. So this is the Pen and Gear, makes circles up to 12 inches in diameter, comes with the pencil and the protractor i'm sorry the compass right here i believe that my son needed this last year and it was like all sold out everywhere so i just got one again it was a dollar and then i did get the protractor because he does need it sometimes for his math class 
And so it says it measures 180 degree angles from both sides, shatter resistant, and this was 50 cents. So you can't beat that deal. Oh, so I did get this for my nephew. My sister um, asked me to get it for him. This was $2.97. I would not have paid that much, but this is the one that he wanted. This is a leather pouch. I was trying to see. It is by Pen and Gear. It says a video game binder pouch, but you see all the little, it has the phones, PlayStation remotes, all the different remotes, Nintendo remote. It does zip up here. So this will be, I guess, his that he uses this year. I was looking to see if it has the dimensions, but it has the three little things that he can clip. And let me tell you, he needs this clipped into something because if not, he will lose it within the first couple days of school because he loses everything. But this was $2.97. And again, it is a better material. So I guess it was worth it. It's like a leather. So that was a good deal. My niece... My sister thought my niece would want these. So they were 88 cents each. So she asked me to pick up two and they are the composition notebooks by Pen and Gear with this adorable sloth on them that rainbows. This is extremely cute. And I thought that she would love it also. I just love it. It's a holographic, it's very cute. 80 sheets, college ruled. Well, when I went through the checkout, I had already paid. My sister texted me and said, never mind, she doesn't like it because it's rainbow. So again, I don't know what she didn't like. This is the cutest little sloth, you guys, and the rainbow, 88 cents each. So I would get these. So I got two that now apparently I own because my niece didn't want them. And then just the last couple of things. Again, guys, all of this that I'm showing you and in my previous video totaled out to $80.06. And so that is a really good deal. Here was just um, the fourth composition notebook I got. That is in the blue. This one is the 100 sheets wide rolled, which again, I didn't realize I got wide rolled. So hopefully they can still use it. This is the another one of the one subjects that I got them that has 70 sheets and this is college rolled. This one is green. And again, they do have where you can, does this tear out? No, yes it does. Right, right there. So you can tear these out. One, two, three, just so you don't have to see them all. These ones were a different price. So these these two are like the plastic ones instead of the paper um, folders. I'm really gonna try not to say on guys. So this one is the yellow and the green. And they are by Pen and Gear. And again, these are the plastic ones instead of the paper ones. They can put their stuff in right here. These ones, I believe, were 40 cents. And then you just clip. It has the three things in here, so you can clip your papers in from the previous notebooks that I bought. So I bought two of those that I believe were 40 cents, and I believe these ones were 25 cents. And I got one, two, three, four of the paper ones, the thick, not really paper, I guess, cardboard ones. I got it in red, green, orange, and blue. And they, again, are by the pen and gear, and they are the prong paper folder. They can put their work in here, and it has the prongs right here to put their papers in. And then apparently I got this kind, which is a pocket paper folder. It's apparently a different kind. They can put a label right here for what subject it is. And we got orange and we got black. These were also 40 cents, I believe. And these just have, no, I'm sorry. They don't have the middle right here. So these were 25 cents. So they have just the little paper things. I don't know who's going to get what or what they're going to need, but I just got a lot of everything and figured that when school starts and I get the list, I will figure it all out. So that, I believe, that is my Walmart haul, you guys. $80 for all of this is a really, really good deal. I did just want to show you three things that I did get from Ross. Ugh, I don't know why everything is stuck together today. So I am always trying to find our cutting board. So we have this huge one that I hate 
bringing out for either strawberries or whatever I'm, bananas, whatever I'm cutting, I hate bringing the huge one out. So I found these at Ross for $2.99 and it says compared to $7. But it says like the green is for veggies, the blue is for fish, the red is for beef, and the yellow is for poultry. I'm gonna use these all, guys, for probably just my fruits and veggies because I use a bigger one on my meats and items like that. And I am always, again, trying to find these little ones for my fruits and veggies. So this is a four pack, flexible and lightweight, non-slip backing, which is awesome. I'm not gonna have to chase it across the counter. And it is by Magic Chef, which I do have some of their stuff and it works very well. And they are each eight inches by 11 inches, perfect size for what I need. So I have those. And then I did get my son two pairs of the, I guess, joggers, or I don't want to say leggings because they probably will be very upset. But these are Jordan joggers, and they're both the same except for two different colors, so I'll show you them. They were $19.99 compared to the $52. And let me assure you, they probably are normally $52 because he, Jordans are incredibly expensive. These are 50 cents. I don't know why I said 50 cents. I meant to say medium, which is not even close to 50 cents. But these are a size medium. They do have the tie in the middle so he can adjust the waist if he wants to. And they are tapered at the bottom, which he really likes. He does not like the, um, there's the, um, he doesn't like the flared at the bottom. He likes them tapered. And then they zip up the sides, which he really likes also. So for $19.99, that's a really good deal. And again, this is the exact same thing, except for in red. These are really bright colors, so I like them. Again, it has the strings. It has the Jordan logo on the butts, and it has tapered legs with the zip right here. So he's really gonna like those. So that is what I spent my day doing at Walmart and at Ross. And I just want to say thank you guys so much. You run out and get those school, because eventually school is gonna start back up. Like whether it be at home or whether it be in the classroom, school is going to start somewhere. And Everyone is going to run out at the same time like they did with the toilet paper and the paper towels and there's not going to be any for you guys to find. So Walmart is having the amazing deals right now. Run out and get them now. I hope everyone is having a great weekend and I will see you guys next time. Bye.